Although I do kind of appreciate that he's getting like just as frustrated as me with Annika's mom. Aaron? I would love to go back there, but, uh... He talks to me in my sleep. He whispers in my ears when I'm awake. His name is Zack. He, he promises revenge. I can't read the writing when it's on top of the bright spots. I don't want to hurt anyone. I just wanted to talk with Annika one last time. What have I done? You fucked up is what you did. screams in my mind he wants me to kill everyone everyone involved in Annika's accident I'm starting to actually want to do it I feel my sanity fading away I can't take this anymore I'm going to end this the only way I can I'm not sure. Oh. I swear I've seen these symbols in my eyes. One of them was here. Okay, so that needs to be upside down, and it is. That one I saw in the basement. Oh, whoops, no, basement. Uh, it's in the back there, so. Oh no, it's over here. This is where I saw it. Uh, okay, so the moon is to the right. That one I saw downstairs. So. You know what? There we go. It was the last one, so it's like, whatever. Uh. Oh. What a horrible noise. Oh, she hung herself. Fantastic. been dead all this time. Gosha summoning ritual recommended to experienced conjurers only. Place five candles in the five-pointed star. Each of the candles is a kiss by the conjurer. As repeating the name of the loved one five times, place an object from the loved one in the center of the circle. Place five branches of ravine around the object inside the inner circle. Break a mirror at 3 a.m. Important. And place it inside the inner circle. Place two drops of blood in the mirror. To finally put the crow feather in the mirror. Recite the words of power. Die guess peck the old bully lefodar. Before you start, it's important to purify your body and mind from any doubts or spiritual impurities that might distract you or make the spell go awry. Meditate until your mind is clear. Focus on your loved one. Many entities are listening. You don't want to make contact with something dangerous. Malignant spirits crave troubled spirits that can be possessed. Banishment ritual strengthened by summoning the help of a friendly spirit. Place five candles the five pointed star. The candles appear and untainted. Place a mirror inside the circle. Must not be broken. Place a grain of salt on top of the mirror. Place an object from the friendly spirit in the salt. Place important. It's important for the object not to touch the mirror. So I'll ask the card between the object and the mirror. Fight the words of power. Blah 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 blah. Oh god, I gotta say. Contacted someone. Someone dangerous. Is there spirit? 
possessed. Possibly. Can you not? Uh. Oh, good. Really don't think I should be here. Well. Do you like salt? Oh. And Donna. They're everywhere. Gross. Oh, hi. I'm not really sure what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh. Well, there's no turning back now. What in the actual fuck? You're either getting closer to the end or closer to the beginning. Your past will decide which. Shit, what the hell? I would appreciate if you did not. What the fuck? Thank you. As above, so below. Hey, that was a, a movie and it was uh, strange. I guess it's... Oh, it's four. It's too late to do the ritual. But yeah, I don't know what any of this means. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with... Oh, here we go. So, oh, there goes stuff. I'm just doing this so there's... One, two, one, two, one, three. That also looks like a one. Oh, there's not a door. Ah. Oh no, this is the hospital. This hospital. We were brought here after the accident. Why am I here? Uh, cause you're in purgatory. Oh, 
not this bitch again! Damn it. Why does she keep following me? Because she wants vengeance for the fact that she died and, uh... You don't see shit. God damn it, no! I don't know where I'm supposed to go, though. Do I need to hide here and then just hope to God she doesn't turn that way? Yeah, can we skip this, please? Damn it. Why does she keep following me? Who knows, man? Oh. So much for hiding. All right, I know what to do now. But I'm almost done the game, I think. Hopefully she can't see me. supposed to come back? That's bullshit! This is where she didn't have to watch the cutscene over and over again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, let's go. This is boring. Why does she keep following me? 
So all the walkthrough says is to get behind a low screen and wait when the monster passes, run back to where it came from. But, like, it doesn't pass by. <sighs> oh, now it's it. Bye, Felicia. Um... I think it's like saying, oh yeah, she's... There we go. What is a photo? Photo! <laughs> ah! It wasn't my fault. It was. That's why it's called an accident. I must do the ritual and end this. Oh, this is the banishment one, right? Place the mirrors at the circle. Place a grain of salt on top of the mirror. Okay. Maldifidi Boli Gistra. Fuck off, weird demon getting off on making people do stuff. You look great. I don't know if that worked. I don't know what happened. Oh, hi. Good, bad. What does it mean? Is it all a matter of perspective? What seems good might turn bad, and what seems bad might turn good. Is it an endless cycle? People say I'm evil, but am I really? Yes. The guilty were punished. The innocent were left alone. Everyone's a sinner. But anyone can change. Um... Bright light. What's going on? I'm back at the motel. I mean, he was carrying on an affair. So he's not a great dude. The town is free. And so is my mom. Achievement unlocked. Good ending. Thank you, Edward. You're a good person. Live your life. You deserve a second chance. I need to go home. My wife needs me. Yeah, then maybe you're gonna have to like be like, yeah, sorry for being a cheating piece of shit. Don't think I forgot about that, dude. Oh my god, why are these credits so slow? Is it because it has a dev team of like five people? Uh, but yeah, um... Not a fan of the game. I'm gonna say that. There are too many really bad decisions to make the overall experience unpleasant. The story is super fucking basic. Like, there's nothing special about it in any way. Like, it, it feels like it's trying to be Silent Hill, and it kind of failed at all of it. Everything is super shallow. Ha! I love how Edward doesn't have top villain. <laughs> But yeah, um, where they place the saves is, like, the checkpoints is really bad. Um, there, it just, there's so much frustration. Uh, it's kind of broken, as you saw in that one bit where the monster got stuck, and then I couldn't progress because it wouldn't trigger cutscene because it was like, oh, no, you're being chased. 
um, it makes you use like the physics engine that like like it's making you use physics, but either the engine that they're using or how they've coded it is really bad. So it's like just really really frustrating. Like during the chase scene with Annika's mom, with that's you know all the furniture is getting in the way, and there's a bit where you have to throw away all the chairs. You know the thing that made me rage quit. <laughs> um, that like it's really bad, and the same with like trying to f make the fence fall over and then some of the puzzles are nonsensical like I have to go and look up a walkthrough to figure it out like like maybe that's on like some of it is like okay maybe that's just on me like the fact that you don't do each room you know you do like I thought it was you would do um what was it summer and it was hunting and then whatever and then you would do um, autumn, uh, which was s some other activity, fishing, I think, and then and then whatever. Uh, okay, uh, but you're supposed to do each room all at once. But that final room with the tiles, I have no idea what that was connecting with. Like, where did it mention a flute? He did mention that there was m it was missing a third. Um, statue but I never saw a third statue and I even walked around the whole damn church because the lighting's kind of shit uh, sometimes uh, whether or not the creatures are gonna kill you isn't very clear uh, so it's like yeah I just I'm gonna have to say I wasn't a fan <laughs> There are some things I liked about it, um, but just all the, the annoyances, the fact that they give the player absolutely zero credit for being able to, you know, think things of themselves. Like, what's the point of having all of these notes and stuff you could find that's saying, you know, what happened and what everyone's doing, when you just end up finding a note that just explicitly spells it out? Like, what's the point? Fuck you. Eat a giant bag of dicks. Then ask me if I'm innocent or whatever. Fuck off. But yeah, whatever. Who knows? I don't know when I'll get around to editing this one. Uh, it's the 31st of July. And I still have a whole bunch of Shadowrun to edit. I still haven't finished Hong Kong. I'm almost done. I really should just bite the bullet and get it finished. But I might not do this until I've moved. So, like, I might not get started with any of this until, like, the end of August or September. I don't know when this is coming out. But anyways, I'll see you guys next time.